October 2023, American Journal of Kidney Diseases, and this article is titled Silica Nanoparticles and Mesoamerican Nephropathy. So what's been going on is in the last, you know, 15 years or so, there's been a big issue with agricultural workers. So people who work on farms in Central America, South America, Africa, India, all over the world in climates that are hot most of the year, and they're finding in a really, really high rate of kidney diseases in this population of people. And it's been a mysterious kidney disease that they don't know what it's from, what causes it. They've termed it Mesoamerican nephropathy. And over the last years, we have discovered of what causes some of this. Looks like we got some more pieces to the puzzle that I'll talk about in a moment. So if you are an agricultural worker, regardless of where you are, Okay, they talk about climate change, it being hotter, and people not as hydrated. So make sure to stay hydrated. You need to drink extra water if you're out in these climates all day uh, and working because you're sweating. You're losing a lot of your water and you don't want chronic dehydration, which has been one of the issues you know, with this mysterious kidney disease. Second, they found that a lot of chemicals that are used, a lot of these chemicals, pesticides, herbicides are not great for the kidneys. So try to protect yourself if you can, if that's even available to you by wearing gloves, protective gear, masks. Now this new study found that in sugarcane workers and people who work with rice also, agricultural workers, they burn these crops at certain points to clear the field, get ready for new crops, but they burn the crops. And when they burn the crops, it emits silica. And what they found is in samples, kidney samples, kidney biopsy samples of these people who had Mesoamerican nephropathy. This was in El Salvador. They found uh, nanoparticles, silica nanoparticles in the kidney tissues. And we know that's damaging to the kidney. It's not good for the kidney. It's bad for the kidney. When they burn these crops by inhaling it, they're inhaling these nanoparticles. Now, if that's part of your job, what you have to do, what's recommended by OSHA, Center for Disease Control, is you try to use an N95 mask or better. Trying to use any mask will be beneficial. Whatever you have to you will provide some degree of benefit, but an N95 or better is ideal. Hopefully you're able to do that. If anybody's looking to help that population anybody you know donating an n95 would be wonderful but that's just another piece of the puzzle but make sure to stay hydrated really really stay hydrated and just practice the best self-care that you can in those situations so thanks for watching everybody into your best kidney health bye